Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nock. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we have Aimless Ambitions in the Third Dimension with Paper and Hugo B Designer. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. I'd really appreciate the support. But without further ado, let's jump into the description. Sometimes we are left to wander alone in sea of pairs. This is one of those times. This pair of money portals is a remake of a Mario fan game combined Super Mario and Portal map pack, hollow purpose created by Hugo B Designer, who also makes excellent Portal 2 puzzles here, here, and who was also played this and gave feedback on this version of his puzzle before I made it public. Cube throwing, intense strafing, and other ninja esque moves are very much unintended. So, this is a 3D realization of a Hugo map from Mario. Okay. This could be interesting. Alright, so that's all we can do for a start. That gives us a funnel. Uh, we can drop a cube. The button there. Panel. It's there. Exits. Ceiling button. Let's go and get a cube. Alright, the cube's on the button. And we can use this panel now to go back up to... Up to well, not back up to, but up to this side. Alright. So, oh, I didn't even check to see what that, oh, so that opens the fizzlers and it reverses the funnel. Okay, so, what if I did this then, I jump down here. And do this. All right. Go here, there's a ledge here. Okay. Recall that cube, that'll bring that into here. Both cubes. And then let's put one over there, that one stays there and gets the exit. Alright, I think we're done. I use the term done very loosely though because it is a it did say something about a two part puzzle. So that's probably more and I just fucking god. Can't believe I just did that. Fine, we'll go back and get the cube. Someone sits there. It goes through. Take the cube here. Like that. Alright, part one, complete. Okay, so we don't have a funnel this time around by the looks of it. Let's 
Alright, does this cube respawn? It sure does. So. All right, I see what I need to do. I think that's what I need to do. I just wasn't quick enough at doing what I needed to do. Oh, yeah. All right. That's got to be useful. Swap around. All right, so I need the other cube. Okay, so if I'm right, we do this. Do this. Push the cube over to us here. Put a portal on here, which reverses the polarity of this funnel. Drag the thingy through. Drag it through, but then what? I know, the funnel is blocking. The funnel is a blocking. I gotta push it up here with the key. Okay, so I gotta reset basically. I gotta do a reset. Um, so that needs to sit on there so I can push it through, right? Right. Oh, 
I'll just leave it there for now. that that does that hey, but then how do I get back How do I get back? So I can't see that from there. Actually, it's not a big thing, actually. Mm, or is it a big thing? Because you're going to need both cubes at the top. If I go through there, I lose the portal. Not only do I lose the portal, but then it swaps these around. Let's do something like this for a start. I don't know, um, because as far as over here. Can I get into there? That's effectively what I need to do, isn't it? Okay, I think I might know what to do. Take this one. For now, we'll leave it there. Just for now. Okay. Then... We'll place... Oh. Let's not put that actually so close to the edge. Let's put it here actually, because we can probably... We can probably bring it back up, right? Okay. So we know that one does nothing. So then we do this which opens that. Now that we have that, I should have placed this here.
But then is this what... Is this what was meant though by no strafing? so sure now. I'm not so sure anymore. I'm not sure anymore. meant to do is I don't know how I would do that though okay so what I'm meant to do is that needs to go in there I need to activate the funnel push it up drop it it flies up to there and then I push it across with the funnel But how do I do that? That's the question. So let's go back. Just uh, let's reset a little bit. To what we had here. So yeah, where's the, where's the optimum position to push this? Put this cube. Where does this cube need to go? My gut feeling is if I put it here, it's just going to move, right? Yeah. So that's definitely not the answer. Uh, where did I save? Oh, boy. Just to uh, get us in a position of reset. Oh, yeah, about that. Oh boy. Did I do this before? Oh, wait a minute. Not exactly how I did it before. I reset these, didn't I? Put these the other way around. That way it comes down slowly. Maybe that's it, actually. Hold on. Maybe that's it. That wouldn't work though, would it? Because that would be pushing. Oh, I don't know. Alright, so this is what we have save spot there. Oh, do you know what? It's not going to matter. It's not going to matter because, and the reason being, why didn't I see this before? Alright, so we're going to leave that there, like we did. We then go... Um, portal on here. It's not going to matter because that is just going to loop around for the time being. 
Or at least it should do. Okay. So, then what we do is we place our portal here. That keeps moved. supposed to leave your seat until the plane reaches the terminal. Alright, so that should be set up like that. We then do this. Then we do this. The cube should still be there. Push it up. Let it go. Oh, no, we just push it up. What am I doing? Just push it up. Let it do that. This one comes across like that. Okay. Then. We respawn the other cube. Then we should be done. Cool map. Cool map paper. Good visualization of a 2D puzzle. I may have to go back to Mario and um, Hugo's map pack and play that again just to see the, uh, the actual map uh, this was based on. But. Um, on maps, sorry. But uh, yeah, Fantastic Puzzle, thank you very much for the suggestion. You did a fantastic job, guys. Thank you very much for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any match rights to pay, please leave in the comments or head to my Google form. A link to that's in the description. But until next time, I've been Ock. You've been awesome. See ya.